Hey guys, I'm Gio Giovanni and thank you so much for watching Word of Gio. Today I want to discuss Harlan Coben's The Stranger, the Netflix series that just came out. Hello, you've reached the Price's family phone. If you'd like to leave a message for... Adam. Corinne. Thomas. Or Ryan. You can do so after the beep. Beep. You didn't have to stay with her, you know? Do I know you? She told you she was pregnant and then she lost the baby. <sighs> she made it up. She was never pregnant. I love you so much. Tell me lies. Did you fake your pregnancy? I need you to tell me the truth. Tell me lies. Corinne? Adam, this isn't what you think. There's more to this. Where's Mum? I don't know. How can you not know where she is? Or do you? I know you two have been having issues for a while. What? Oh. You know something that I don't. Where's a shoe? Over here! Get an ambulance and call for backup! We've reason to believe that your wife was at the scene of a murder. This doesn't make any sense. This stranger turns up all mysterious and drops bombs on people and then just gone. Is this some kind of joke? Please don't tell Dad. This stops now. What is it with you and your mother sticking your noses into our business? Now you know she's a liar. Nobody wants this to be happening. How's that lovely wife for yours? I think we're done here. She had to be stopped. Oh my God. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Is this some kind of a trick? Just want to find her. We all have our secrets, Anna. Even you. Okay, guys, I really, really enjoyed this show. So much so that I binge watched it over the weekend. I just could not stop watching it. It was so suspenseful and so good. What I really liked about it is just all of the twists and turns in the entire series. The main series surrounds this family where it's the mom and the dad, and then there's these two boys. One day, this strange woman shows up and she's talking to the dad and she's like, hey, guess what? You know, your wife, she faked her pregnancy. She had an abortion and you didn't have to stay with her. So this sets off this series of, okay, the dad is like, you know, he confronts his wife and then she disappears, you know, before, before she disappears, she's like, you know, this is not what you think this is. There's more to it than that. Okay, you know, yes, I faked my pregnancy. Yes, I lied to you, but there's so much more involved. But she doesn't tell him what is involved. Then she just leaves and disappears, leaves her family. Okay. That part to me was just so crazy because I'm like, who would leave their family? No one would leave. Okay, yes, you lied about something, but you're not just going to up, take off, and leave your young kids, you know, with their dad. Okay, so that happens. Then this strange woman keeps going around, revealing all these deep dark secrets about people <laughs> basically confronting them and saying hey i know your secret and if you don't want the whole world to know you have to pay me you know ten thousand euros so naturally people are going to pay her but then there are others that are like no i'm not paying you shit you know what i'm saying <laughs> it's so good guys you have to check it out because really i don't want to give the whole plot away but i will say to you that it does not end the way that you think it's going to end and it's actually a little sad i would love to discuss this with you in the comments if you have seen it but i am not one for spoilers because i feel like you know if you if you you don't want to spoil it i, I don't want people spoiling things for me so i'm not going to be like oh this is what happened blah 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 generally speaking this this show is just really great i thought it was really well done the characters are well thought out the plot is thick with so many twists and turns and but i do feel like certain things happened in the story that didn't really translate to real life. Like I feel like in mysteries and horror shows and stuff like that, if I hear that something is in the basement and I'm the only one in the house, guess where I'm not going? I'm not going to the basement. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like in shows where yes, they're trying to build drama and they're trying to build suspense, 
but I'm leaving the house. I'm not going down to the basement knowing that nobody's in the house and here I am creeping around like, oh, who's in the basement? Mm, no thanks, right? <laughs> so stuff like that kind of drove me mad and I saw a few instances of that where it just didn't translate to real world. But other than that, I feel like the show is really good. I really enjoyed it and I think you should check it out.